we've been wanting to film, right? And it's running. Alright, wait, do you mind? There's like silent. Yeah. 2018 carrier, two and a half times. Yeah, I think this one has been running. Cool, scroll compressor doesn't replace one of these, sadly. I think I caught my burp on camera. I don't think so, because I think I had it paused. There's these two units. I actually got this one starting up back then. The data sheet looks kind of weird, so. Oh, and it's running. Brand new carrier. You guys remember that silver green plastic that we filmed a week ago? Well, it got replaced. Yeah. Look at that data sheet. Holy crap. It's got the helicopter fan blades. Look at the data sheet. Oh, yeah, that's weird. Carrier changed their data sheets. That's 2018. And that's a two and a, and half, a half time. time. Yeah, it's a 16 seer unit. Nice. That's a very cold suction line. I can't believe it. It's got a really good install. Oh, yeah, that's, actually that's a very that's nice. Scroll, not an LG. Yeah, I'm very surprised. So carrier has not. No longer using LG. Like, oh, nice. I caught. I missed the shutdown, but you caught it. Yeah, I, I caught it. Yeah, that's a nice, uh, quiet shutdown sound. Yeah, these, these are good units. I'm pretty sure, uh, you know what, never mind, Kyle's not getting a carrier, another one. It's got very good bearings on it, too. Yeah, that's got like a Gentec, right? Yeah, it's a Gentec. It's got a very good install, which is very surprising, because all of these, are, most of these are badly installed. Easy to get this one starting up. Yeah. All right, let's, um, uh, yeah. I no, actually, I filmed those. Frames. It's not fake. And I, I don't want people telling me like, oh, you should take the logo. And no, I don't. I, I didn't tell you you should take the logo. Oh, yo, guys, look at this parking. <laughs> this freaking idiot parked so bad. The sign says no parking, bitch. Guys, I'm not going to fast shame anyone. There's a fat ream unit right there. Sorry, guys. But I don't think I filmed those units, actually. There's a ream unit. I think the fan motor just, oh no, that's the original actually. Two ton from 2009. R410A. Guys, there's a Westinghouse I got starting up and a Zephyr. I got that Westinghouse starting up one time. Oh yeah? Yeah, you haven't even saw the video, I think. No, I don't think I have. There's a York and a GMC. Is this it? No, that's not it. I actually got that one running. It was actually loud. You can actually. Oh yeah, I can kind of see it from here. Yeah, you can see. Yeah, there's the American Standard. Probably a 1300. Er, yeah, you're right. Speaking of train XL 1400, there's one of them right over there, but you can't go into it. Yeah, you know what? This thing excels. Van, speaking of train XL 1400, there's an XR 1400 over there. There's no such thing as that. Yeah. What the heck are those fruits? No, those are like squash and cucumbers, you don't tell me. Squash and cucumbers at the same time? That's a pretty nice neighborhood right here. I have here. five minutes to film, so... There's a uh, Ream and Goodman. Oh, that Goodman's brand new, I know that. There's one of my favorite Lennox Merits right over there. Those are actually good units. Yeah, I don't like the Elite nor the Dave Lennox, because the Dave Lennox, the fan blades are actually plastic, you know? Yeah. Where? Oh, that one? No, that one. You see oh, that? Oh yeah, that one. Yeah. That's badly installed. Where's the airflow? How are you gonna get? How the hell are you gonna get that thing down and remove it? I don't know from here. <laughs> Probably for here because you can't even fit it from like in the backyard. Yeah, I mean it's a classic series, old design, so it kind of lasts a while. Can I get a chicken burger top then? Yeah, look at that. But you can like go through here, and that's it. You're right here. All right, now the first two units I see is the Nordine and the Ream. I believe that's a Philco. That thing looks pretty interesting, that Nordine. Yeah. Got a, that's a very tiny unit right there. I guess we can fill these. Yeah. Here's a Ream. 
Nordine Classic and a Nordine. I've this actually one. never seen a Nordine with two fan blades before. There's more right over there. There's more Ring Classic. This one does not have a micro channel. Oh, shit. Oh, it's a truck. I'm not pausing the camera every time. These are a very terrible install. Yeah. Honestly, they are very terrible installs. Oh. There's another Nordine. That one has micro channel, the other one doesn't. Fan motor. There's a cigarette lighter in here. So okay. which way do we go to get to the, the, the ring turds and the new ones? Ring turds? Are you kidding me? Reams are good. Oh, look at this. That one's quiet. All right, guys, we have arrived. There's a pain. Uh, nice sorry about that. And a pain. Copeland scroll. That pain has not been running. Oh yeah, there's the unit that got replaced. Yeah. It's running. I've been wanting to film this thing for a while. It's got a very nice sound of it. 2017. This is probably the energy guide. One and a half. That's actually not all that cold. Maybe it just turned on. It's like smooth air blowing out of this thing. All right, there's a ream, two reams right here. They're still surviving, I can't believe it. That's a very rusty there's unit. More you know what that rusty one looks like? It kind of reminds me of the 80s reams, you know? Yeah. I think I heard a unit shut off. Guys, I remember I filmed these Janitrols. There's a smashed one. What? We have a ride that Janitrol and then Start over here. Yeah, be careful. That one actually sounds pretty uh, interesting. This one's got a Copeland Recep as well. I'm gonna get the data on one of them. Yeah, 96. This is a CKHT. Uh, there's a Copeland Recep. I think one of them just got replaced. There's a pain right over there. Oh, there's a Nordine. Philco. You got a Philco. Nice. And it's been running. Oh, I just shut off. Yeah, actually, no, the fan motor's not. Look at that lizard, dude. I feel bad for that thing. That lizard died. Yeah. More Janitrols. This one has a Bristol in it. Uh, Tecumseh. Look at that. I'm sorry, my camera doesn't want to focus today. I heard a unit turn on. Did you hear it? Yeah, I just heard one of those. I think it was. That, I think it was that Nordine. Yeah. Yeah, it was definitely this thing. It's rattling. Did you hear a unit turn on? Oh. What the heck? What is this thing doing? Maybe it's short sighted. No, I just heard something different. Did you hear that click? Look, this one has a Tecumseh. Oh wait, no, that's a Copeland. That one's not good. Okay. Yeah, we can actually skip those because like that's pretty interesting. All right, this one just turned on right here, and then we got a duck right there. It's pretty funny. That's a big fan motor hack job for this thing. Big fan motor hack job. Yep. And we got a duck. This one just shut off. Geo scared the duck. This one has a... Tecumseh. Yeah. Oh, yo, that compressor is sweating. It must be over uh, heating. There's, there's a smash to Janitrol right there. I have three minutes left to record, so... Right. I'm going to delete that startup video after I do this. Janitrol. Yeah, just start up. Wow, all of them has fan motor hack jobs. They're all loud. I'm pretty interested. This one is super loud. What a nice sound. Copeland reciprocating. Nordine's running. Very quiet. Yo, that thing is frozen up. Yo, look at that. Look at that kink. Look at that kink right there. Holy crap. Yeah, it's got a leak. And a kink. Oh, there's a duckless unit. It's a classic DC inverter. Classic. Oh, yeah, I remember you this one. This is a NWHA, one and a half ton. All right. Not uh, very useless to film. 
Oh, yeah, that one has the electrical out. That's dangerous. That's, uh, that's a capacitor. That could probably send you... Oh, that's a brand new pane right there. Yeah, I can tell that. That thing is brand new. There's a brand new pane. This one has a Copeland scroll compressor. It's from 2018. All right.